let's demonstrate an effective strategy for playing a default round on the T side of Mirage. The goal is to control important parts of the map, collect information on enemy activity, and use their weakness against them. Player 1 goes toward A ramp and holds for any CT aggression. When you have a decent spawn, you can easily get into this position close to the site. Here it's easy to listen for information such as how many players there are and how much utility they have been used. Player 2 heads towards the palace and holds for CT aggression. Stand close in this corner and listen for information on the A site. If the enemy expects you to stand in this position, place yourself in an off angle like this. Player 3 heads towards mid and holds either connector or window. Most of the time you can easily get to the other side of the top mid boxes without taking any damage. While holding a position like this, you should be aware of any player coming out short. Player 4 walks through the underground to hold either the connector or window. This is such a powerful position, because it allows you to easily gather information about rotations from mid, the B site, and short. Player 5 goes to B apartments and holds for any CT aggression. Stay close to the site to be able to listen for enemies rotating or moving around. You can also hold an off angle like this. When all five players are in place, keep holding the positions until there are 60 seconds left on the clock. A lot can happen during this time, so use the gathered information wisely to make the best possible decision moving forward.